Just because they have the whole seed bank th thing there and everything. In case the world goes under, you know. Thanks, Lif. McMurdo Station? That sounds like a mad place for people to get killed in, in like fiction. I never heard of that. <laughs> I never heard of that before. Though, what's that about? I also learned of like an island out in like the Pacific Ocean that's like owned by New Zealand, but has like 30 people on it. But still, ha they still have like modern luxuries and stuff. Like they have internet there and everything, and like there's people, there's people who go out and like get food for the island and stuff, and like bring it back on boat. But it takes like a long ass time. <laughs> I forget what the island's called again, because, like, it, again, it's a place that I don't think about. I, I looked it up randomly, like, a long ass time ago, but, yeah. It's pretty neat to see how, like, society like that still, like, March society still functions like that in, like, such a low population. Big Burrow Station, the Big Mac. Reach the station at Arca. Oh, okay, it's so opposite side of the globe entirely then. I guess people are kind of living there because, like, yeah, I guess people are living there then because, like, they have to, they have to for science. That's like scientists, though. Outside of scientists, like, regular ass people living in, uh, in living in Svalbard are, are a thing. We live in a joker. In the history of various attempts for South Pole and what they age, was it their dogs and science? Ugh. Just done? Yay! Clean, clean, clean dishes, clean, friendly friends. <laughs> My mind's all over the place today. I'm thinking about PMD again. Oh no. Soink? I agree. Catch the line if you were Mr. Judging Pokemon. Uh, well, if I was Mr. Judging Pokemon, I'd probably be a Buizel then. So, like, she Bui, I guess. <laughs> Boring answer, but it makes sense. Or just be a random noise. No, you mean it'd be like a random noise? Yeah, Tanny's would just be fast. Probably a Teddy Ursa or something. Or an Ursa Ring. Mommy Burger Burger. Like the restaurant? Ayo. Delicious. There's a restaurant in Mall of America called Burger Burger that I passed by. Like, when I was at DQ. I just like I just like the name Burger Burger. I don't know why. Burger times two. Burger times burger. It goes delicious. Like hello, I am we. We tear some obsessive hamburgers. Bless them not not feeding my life. Ooh, there you go. That works. There you go, perfect. Take that, Yogi Bear. That's right. What are you gonna do, Yogi Bear? <laughs> Can't handle not having that picnic basket. That is true, you, you just steal food instead. You just steal those picnic baskets. To be fair, my only Yogi Bear exposure is like when they're in when when they're when they're in the episode of Billy and Mandy. Like growing up. That's like that's like the only like experience I have of Yogi Bear. 
And that shit was funny. Lean level. Is it gonna be a rainbow? Rainbow? Maybe? Ayo? Ah, oh, barely not. That's so good. Because they're in Wii Wii Shop is in, is in VC. Uh, apparently, Affordable Space Adventures is okay. I don't know anything about it, but I read an article like a while ago about like Wii U and 3S exclusives that are good to look at. And like most of them are 3S exclusive games, but that was one of the games I remember that was mentioned there. There's not a whole lot of exclusives on Wii U that are, like, super worth it, as far as I'm aware. That, that one might be worth looking into. Big advocate of it? Oh, yeah, there we go, then. You already, you, you already got it in that case. I don't know what else, then. Oh, if you play the Pushmo games on 3DS, there is a Pushmo World on Wii U, apparently. Pushmo being another 3DS exclusive game. 3S eShop exclusive games, so like, yeah. I know that's on there too. In terms of non VC stuff, though, like, nothing I looked at looked look interesting to me. And it was all stuff I saw on 3S VC, anyways. But like, on Wii U instead. It wasn't good stuff either. I tried Pushmo out on 3DS. It was alright to me, but I'll probably get more into it. There's probably more mechanics that I have to like look that I probably unlock more the more I play it or something. Cause it wasn't huge about the early levels at least. There are that's good then. I keep doing this far wrong. Do we have any more sluices? A lot more. There are actually three games I saw, I saw on Wii U that I, I wanted again. I, I wanted to get at some point. Now I was looking through the eShop. That is Paper Mario Color Splash, which I've heard good things about like after everything about the game has died down. Uh, Kirby and Rainbow Curse, and that uh, was one more. I'm forgetting what it is though. There's one more. Ah, uh, was it? Oh yeah, Twilight Princess HD. Those three. I want to get those three. Like now that like things have calmed down, the like. With the Wii U in general. And also, I want, I want, yeah, it was like those three I want to get on Wii U. And like none of those are on are on, uh, on on Switch. So yeah. Yeah, I, I really want to get TPHG. Ah, uh, literally. That's fine. I should be okay... Over here. Yeah, okay. We only we got one bubble. That's the important part. Holy moly. Uh, look at how big this best is here. All because I got the early hits, and I got one bubble. All, all because I got, I got the grab on the back there and got one bubble, I mean. This is gonna be a huge best. Okay. I can now see why 32 is more possible. <laughs> it's because I wasn't doing that strat properly. Look at this. God dang, 8 second best split because of that. That saves way more time than I thought I did. Holy moly. Splash is very charming. You like, so you start not getting like Hover Splash. I've heard it's an improvement. I thought Origami King was okay. So, like. Now, I've, heard, I've heard good things about Color Splash now than it before. So, I think I, I, think I want to like try it out still. Also, funny thing, I noticed that Color Splash is actually more expensive in the eShop than it is on, like, eBay. And same deal of Rainbow Curse as well, too. So, uh, if, you, if you're getting anything on the Wii, on Wii UVC between now and, like, when you can add more funds to the eShop, to the e uh, don't get that on eShop. Get that, like, on eBay. <laughs> Kirk Pine Pamela would be not to play yourself best below 33. I re wish I realized sooner that I could save so much time in that boss fight. <laughs> that is true, though. It would, like, destroy my son of the best currently. That's actually really sick. 
I really get I really need a PB again. I really need to. Oops. I don't know why I jumped there. I need to like stop choking on like 6-2 and I'm the final boss. I really need to. I got this time and then like I've been stuck here for the last few days. I'm glad it's at least there overall. Like, I'm glad it's at least overall improvements, because, like, that makes sense. Oh, yeah, it, it's the game without my life with me. Yeah, that's, like, the, that's so good. And honestly, Origami King had a lot of stuff like that, too, that was, like, really funny about it. My wife left me. <laughs> Just kicks Mario. <laughs> Can't believe Mario can honestly cause the divorce. That's wild. I don't know the context. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot. It also, so the big reason why I like Larry Koopa is now my now one of my favorite Koopalings is because of the art from Paper Mario Color Splash. <laughs> I forgot about that. Look at Larry Koopa's like Color Splash artwork. It's like. It's, the pose he makes there, the face expression he has, is just like too perfect. It really is. Like that p lone piece of art is what made me really actually like Larry Koopa a lot, <laughs> compared to the other Koopalings. It's just so sassy and funny. It's the one lying down. Yeah, that one's really freaking good. <laughs> if you want to look in chat real quick, if you wouldn't mind. It's so good. Because <laughs> I, I was big on uh, Iggy before, because Iggy sounds really funny in Smash Ultimate and Smash 4. I was big on them before, but now Larry is my favorite because, because of the art from Color Splash. <laughs> but one of the reasons, I was like the design too, as well, too, of course. But yeah. You sassy and funny? Thank you. I'm doing my best out here. I stay unsassily. <laughs> Can compose a unique personality and cover splash and shine surface perfectly. That's so cool, actually. I love that. If I just take to go Okay, I need to play this game. What the hell? Why are people crapping on it so much first came out? Other than the obvious, like, not RPG sort of complaints. God dang. Because Sugar Star? Yeah, never mind, you're right. I was gonna remember, people are gonna complain people are gonna complain about stuff because the mob like hates it as well too without even looking into it. That's just gonna happen. I always gotta remember that. Sometimes it's good to just like look like step back and like assess something like yourself, you know. Form your own opinions and stuff. That's an other in that loop bloom. <laughs> that's the obvious one, is that's not like the first two games. Therefore, it's bad. But people also didn't like Sticker Star, and they're valid for that, for sure. Damn! That's a hot opinion. I love T2ID, even with the bat track and, like, some of the stuff like that. I will say, I think overall, like, the original is still the best Paper Mario game. Because I think the, the highs in, in Paper Mario, the original, are not as high, but the lows are not as low as it's TTYD. 
I think that's important to note. I think the highs in TTYD are higher, and the lows are lower in TTYD as well. I like both of them too. They're both like about equal, I'd say, overall. I don't think either one's really better than the other, but in my opinion, that's that's how it is. Yeah, I agree about General White. That part is like weird. Chapter 4 is also a lot of backtracking too. That's I think overall was a fun experience, but yeah. That's just that's just the lows though. The highs are very good though. Like, I love chapter six. It's wild because chapter six has like is like not really many fights at all. It's just like dialogue and just like talking to people, but still like super memorable because of the whole like just because of the idea of it. The mirror mystery on the Excess Express. And for a lot of people, it's their favorite just because of the writing. And that's the thing that's I think that's genuinely really cool. I only lost time in the end because I still have I still had support him there. I was able to jump earlier. <laughs> yeah, I think that's hilarious. If you read the ghost diary, it tells you not to read. Just die. <laughs> just came over. <laughs> it's actually so good. You get like a few lines in, you're just like, well, I told you I'd read my diary! Ooh! And then you just die. <laughs> Bollywood's alright. It's definitely one of the weaker chapters, but it might be, it's still kind of fun. I still overall enjoy the game out. Is that a rainbow? Cool, rainbow. Hate the music? Dang. I think it's cool and atmospheric, personally, but I respect that opinion. Oh, my, my game is freezing again. No, it's doing the thing again. I hate when that happens. It'll unfreeze itself in a second. It's cool, cool port. <laughs> there we go. I was holding fast forward the whole time. Thankfully, it does not affect IGT. Let's go. So I still got a rainbow despite the fact that the game froze for 10 seconds. I'm just doing it like that. I think it's easier than trying to do any other strat right there that I can think of. Let's get the skip first try. My run earlier got a second try. It was like a fast second try though. Let's do this. Oh, I got it. It didn't jump though for some reason. Damn it. Damn, that happens. Alright. Again, the fast second try. So we'll still save time as long as I get the cycle here. That was very weird again, but whatever. We still got it. Cool. It has been done. We still saved... Oh, six seconds. Oh, actually, it's seven seconds this time. Nice. I guess I failed faster on that first attempt than my last attempt where I failed fast as well, too, so... Hey. Shrug. Oh. You have to jump at the perfect time there in order to get past them. It's hard. It's also not a necessary time save at all by any means, so that's neat.
Oh, I also mentioned, speaking of exclusive, I also mentioned uh, Rainbow Curse at one point. Even though, like, I don't like Canvas Curse as much anymore, thanks to Spear in that game. And, like, trying to go fast in it. I want to get Rainbow Curse, because, like, I still think Canvas Curse is a fun casual game. It just never speedrun it. And I did enjoy it casually, which is why I tried to run it. Also because of the Kirby Series Relay, but yeah. So I want to try Rainbow Curse, because, like, I know the soundtrack is really good in that game. I love the art style in that game as well, too. And, like, Canvas Curse is fun casually. It's fine. So I, I want to I try it. I want to give it an honest shot. Have a good time. The one thing I do know about that game is that it has a lot of auto-scrollers, which are hard in the context of Rainbow Curse, where it's constantly moving. And Canvas Curse, too. But yeah. Still sounds fun and interesting to me. Yeah, Claymation's awesome. I love it. I love Claymation in general. It's off button to some people, and I get that, but like... I don't know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a nerd about that sort of thing. I really am. I'm a nerd, I'm a, I'm a nerd about cool-looking animation. I hate when it happens. Unfortunate. Please! Okay. Ooh, ah. Alright, lost a cycle there, but we're still on track. It's fine. Let's go to the animation, nerds. Let's go. I can't have it much casually, but Raymond Curse is a little more fine to me. Was I gonna get stuck as easily? Yeah, probably. It's probably more polished just because of the system it's on compared to DS, which, like, I'm not gonna say it has jank, but it can be very jank depending on the game. And for Can Canvas Curse, it does seem like it would be pretty jank in a lot of places compared to, like, Canvas with the Rainbow Curse. The level design and the music in Canvas Curse are very fun. Thanks, Fox and Bananas. They're looking pretty good right now, too, yeah. It's mostly because I learned how to beat the second boss faster. Despite the fact that it's very luck based. I've now learned how to mitigate the luck a bit more, which like gave me a big best there earlier. I can still save a lot more than that best too, considering Yeah, just I can still save a lot more than that best as well too. So yeah. It's looking good right now, is what I'm trying to say. We're doing well. We're fast. Speed. This run, lately especially, is literally not over till it's over, though. We are speed. Also, we're doing well in that. Much of pretty off point, I just understand but new stuff is very good. New stuff is very, very good. Ever seen Kubo and the Two Strings? That's a movie that I thought was, was 3D, like, animated until, like, I saw apparently like a, a little like video about it af after the facts, and it's all claymation. It's all like stop motion and claymation, and it's really freaking cool. I love it too. That movie's awesome. I saw it on a flight one time. And I was I was blown away. It's a really freaking good movie. Beyond just the fact that it looks gorgeous. Okay, I don't know how that just happened, but sure. It like wasn't. I keep having the thing happen where it just doesn't jump immediately. Oh. Well. Saw in theaters? Hell yeah. Wish I saw it in theaters. Wish I could have supported the movie in some way, but it's okay. At least I saw it and enjoyed it. It's been so long since I've seen it, though, at this point. But damn, that's a good movie. He does it in Blunder? I didn't know about that. I knew he does claymation stuff, or I knew he does, like, some sort of, like, weird-looking 3D animation stuff. I knew it was claymation. That's cool. Yeah, weird-looking the stuff in general is really good.
I like his animation. This is nice. I haven't seen much of Big Top Burger though. I, I gotta check that out sometime. Oh, he's done Big Top Burger more recently. Other, he's also done stuff for Adult Swim too, which is really cool. It's all right. Yeah. I know Jeff obsesses over it. <laughs> Oops. I had no idea MA and Blunder. I had no idea. That's so cool. I gotta try Blunder myself at some point. It's, I want I wanna learn how to do that sort of thing. Just like well. It takes time and effort and messing around with stuff. I want I want to invest the time into it. Eventually, o'clock. Let me just stop listening to song Anomalisa. I never heard that before. What's that about? One of my favorite stop motion movies, by the way, in general, is Coraline. I freaking love Coraline. Holy shit. That's a good movie. Remember when I watched that on my Discord a while ago? That was a good time. Just because I was like, this movie's really good, y'all should see it. <laughs> that was a good time. I think that's pre pandemic as well, too. I think it's like 2019. That's wild, Torsi. Jeez, Louise. That's so cool. I love that. Sort of, I really love that sort of thing. Just the little details. It's the little details that always get you, you know. The little stuff that you see, like in, in any like work like that, that you go back and just like do a double take on. Cause you can catch it the first time, but the second time it blows your mind, you know. Just tiny little things. That's dope. Oops. Oops. Ah, I almost went to the right. That would have been bad. I almost forgot. <laughs> there we go. Another Christ and there was a movie except for like two characters all voiced by Tim. I don't know who Tom Newton is, but that's actually kind of cool, honestly. Sounds a little like artsy fartsy, just with a, with a description a little bit, but like not in a bad way. Just having been voiced by like one person pretty much is like interesting to me in, in that regard. And to me it says something about like the characters themselves without even like knowing what the movie's about. Or without having like seen the movie. You know what I'm saying? Why is it, why does Charlie Kaufman sound familiar? What what movies is in, was, was, has Charlie Kaufman made? Because I know I've heard that name before. Why does it sound familiar? That's what it was. Yeah, movie I've not seen, but I've heard only good things about over the years. There you go. Oh, sports up. There we go. Ippa got eaten there. I was like, what happened? <laughs> I don't know why either. I don't know why Ippa got eaten there. I, I pressed the button, but whatever. Oh, was that why? Oh my god. <laughs> I did not- I- okay, that- that makes more sense. <laughs> Jeez, I don't even know who that was, and yet that brought up like if that brought up some sort of reaction in my mind. What the hell? <laughs> That's wild. The mind is the funny thing, I guess. It really is. Could be a director? Yo, good for him. Good for him. Let's go. I 
I'm surprised like two of those shots hit, but I'm glad. Because that's fast. FAST! Well, I can be a house builder like his father. Fair, fair, fair. Whoops. Ah. Ah. I'm not playing this well. Damn it. Alright, well, that's fine so far. Oh, okay, please, 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 please. No! Oh, I got the long attack too. I was I was slow there. Damn, that sucks. Alright, well, time lost then. R.I.P. Barely hit. Nice. Thank goodness. Are we still say time? Good. All right. You're just thinking at best because of that one, because of the extra attack there, because of the long attack. But yeah, Thrones doing pretty well still. We take those. Ooh. I need a checkpoint and then die. Oh, because because there's invisible wall there. That's why. I can't I can't get up there at all. There's invisible wall there. So like yeah. On easy mode, you're able to actually hit the checkpoint using the longer range of the wind ring. You can't do that on a uh, normal mode or hard mode, as far as I'm aware. Are they polymer? I bought them yesterday. I should know this. I thought I thought they were all seven bucks. Why is range original and then like ten? I swear to God, I bought it yesterday for seven as well. I could be wrong, but I got all three of them yesterday. Heck, <laughs> oh well. Bears, we also can't skip this level here due to due to another visible wall. There's an invisible wall above the uh, yellow crystal. I rather the yellow heart that we break, like after hitting the yellow crystal. I mean, there's a visible, there's a visible wall up there. I okay. <laughs> Whoops. There we go. <laughs> That's fine. I think it's still some time here if I play the rest well. There's, there's a visible up there that we can like sport jump up to, but unfortunately we can't skip the rest of the level and get to the, right to the very end from the start because of that wall there. I'll show it once it once it get near there in a second, because we're go we're going right by it soon. It's right underneath where the blue crystal is. Or the blue like hard looking thing is. Right there, see? Up there where that checkpoint is, is also another visible wall, but it's like above us. It's like an invisible ceiling instead, basically. And we can't skip the whole level by just support jumping up there from the start because of that. Okay, that was actually like really fast in the end. Let's go de-boosting. That was uh, not what I wanted to have happen, but it worked out well. So I'm not complaining. I think you can, yeah. It's just a movie I haven't seen before, being John Malkovich, but I've heard it's a good one. I can't believe the name Charlie Kaufman sounded familiar to me because there's a person I, I apparently knew growing up <laughs> that I've since forgotten about, and that's why that name is familiar to me. <laughs> Not because it's the name of a director of the exact same name. That's like director they like apparently a really good movie that a lot of people know about. That's actually really funny to me. <laughs> Yo, Charlie Kaufman, if, you, if you're out there, hit me up. Let's reconnect. <laughs> Sorry for forgetting about you. Hope you also forgot about me so it's less awkward. <laughs> you know what the messed up part is, Balmer? I knew someone with the with the exact opposite name name there. Like flip flip James Cameron backwards. I knew someone whose name was that. I don't want to go into the name any longer though. 
because I I said it was. That's all. That's all I'll say. Wait, no, I'm thinking of someone else. Never mind. I'm thinking, I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of someone else. Never mind. I'm thinking of someone else when I said that. I think that thing is still good. I think you're still good. Is this someone I knew when I was like single digit ages? I'm sorry, frick. Ah, I feel weird now. That's on me. Ah. I, d I did actually, though. I did actually know someone whose name was Cameron James. I did know someone whose name was that. Not James Cameron, but the other way around. I'm not, I'm not even getting on that one. Who's someone whose name was Nora Maximaj? Oh, ba oh, James Cameron, ba uh, Cameron James backwards. Never mind. Not that, no. <laughs> not that. Not like that backwards, you know? <laughs> That one took me a second. Their name also sounds very interesting, though. Now, I'd like to know them. You someone from high school whose name was was Valentina Valenti. <gasps> Hold on, I'm gonna concentrate. You need to get out of the way, Moo. Like, right now. I don't know why I just support jump there, but whatever. Okay, we're gonna just like concentrate for this level because we're on good pace. I think that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> and I've been choking here like for a while. I think we're going to full concentration mode now for the rest of the run. <laughs> good conversations, y'all, but, but Papa's got a PB. Playing that safely. Should've gone for my Shyamalan. You should have, it looks it, it seems like. You made a mistake. And you know what? It's okay. That's how you know you're human. Crystal Waters sounds something like someone's made up name. That they use to sell drugs under. That's what that sounds like to me. <laughs> Fast! High school's name is Jesus Jesus Christ. Or is it was it spelled like Jesus Chris oh like Jesus Chris T like that? I'll, I'll look at the answer after the skip right here. Let's do this. Oh my god, I, I did the thing. I don't think it's gonna work. It still worked! Okay, good. I, I had no faith. Let's go. Alright, cool. Slow first try. That's good. Let's get the fast fight, please. Those first two scare me. Those first two moves here scare me. I need all four of these moves to hit him. At the start here. Alright, that's a good start. Let's go. That's a good start. And now it's all on me. Oh crap, uh, that's weird. I didn't know I can do that there. That definitely delayed the next phase. <laughs> Alright, well, we did not get the, the quick kill, unfortunately. We are just barely off. That's totally okay, because my best play has not had that quick kill in it, ever. There we go. We're still on pace, so we can still 33 this. That's what I want out of this run. Let's friggin' go. Thanks for like, thank you. <laughs> I saw that last second. <laughs> thank you. Oh my god.
I almost forgot. Thank you very much. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna not miss a single throw right here. And it's gonna be epic. I'm going to take this slowly and safely, and avoid the tongue, and it's going to be great. There we go. It does not matter how slowly I avoid the tongue there, as long as I avoid it, because I still have 1k and left after that phase. It does not matter. And he's going to laugh here twice regardless. All that matters is how fast I get this. I'm saying that out loud because I constantly forget this fact. But it's a very important one. Oops. Bam. Alright, we're good. That's first phase done. Bam. Fast. I'm pointing right now. Fast. <laughs> it's, it's not annoying, Sniper. Actually, it's really helpful. Thank you very much. I thought that was too early. <laughs> Thank goodness it wasn't. Good. Oh! It's fine. Good, 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 good. Now we wait like right here ish. Good. Nice! Perfect second phase. Alright, last phase is chokeable. But, I'll, I'll do my best. Whew. I'm gonna play it safely. There we go. Actually, I was probably like the fastest way I could have done that. I wasn't even like playing it safely. It's just like, I was just playing it, period of sentence. Glad I still hit. I'm so glad. I had not, I had no faith. <laughs> I thought it too early. Alright, we're in a weird spot right now. I gotta, I gotta get him on the next, on the next go around. Here we go. Like this. We were in a weird spot right there, but we're good now. Now we're in a good spot, cuz... Oh, mama. One more. Oh, this attack is weird. It's a weird one to deal with. Nice! Let's go. Let's go. That's a 33. Let's freaking go. I didn't care that hit me. GG. Let's go. Let's go. Hell yeah! Finally got a 33! Hell yeah, dude! Let's go! Oh my god, that took so long to get another PV. <laughs> nice! Let's freaking go, y'all! That took so long to get! Hell yeah! Oh man! There were a good amount of mistakes in this run still, but like, that was a good run, honestly. I don't want to like stop until I like get at the very least the fast Gadius kill in a, in a best splits or in a PB or something. I still can't believe I haven't gotten that once in a run yet. And I've gotten it many, many times in practice, but like, yeah. But it's not apparently I have just a shitload to save on seed off, so that's that's neat too. I think we'll wait and like study up that 32 round whenever it does get approved, or if it does get approved in the future. Apparently it's not old record. I was uh, a monster in chat told me today because he's, he's a mod on the leaderboards. Is someone apparently submitted a 32 many time to the leaderboards, which I didn't even know is currently possible with the current strats. So I want I want to see how that's possible first and foremost, and then I'm gonna like look at that run and then like do more attempts once that's done. I think. For now, though, my goal is a 33, and that was still, by all means, a solid run. 
there were some like some decent sized mistakes in there. And I can still say like a good amount right now. For now, it's a solid run. At Dune, I should go back to Forgotten Lands because I need to prepare for a marathon. And I'm, I'm a bit rusty at that game right now. So I'm gonna take a break from this and go back to Forgotten Lands. But I finally have a run up. I want to upload to YouTube though. So that shouts to that. <laughs> so hi YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> Hi YouTube, I've been spearing this game for the last three weeks. It's really cool. <laughs> Hope you enjoy something that's not Kirby. <laughs> I love the music abruptly cuts out right there. But yeah, I guess that being said, though, uh, I'm going to prepare for PMD. I'm, I'm going to let all the end credits play out because I think it's just a good idea after the run's done. We can all cry out just a little bit. It'll be okay. I'm going to prepare PMD real quick while this is going on. And also take a little break myself. I think that's I think it's a good time to transition over to that for sure. Night Taurus 3, you have a good one. I'll see you around. Good stuff though, let's freaking go, y'all. Oh wait, well I'm do hold on, before you even do that, hold on. Uh I need to post my PB to Twitter. That's the thing I need to do. So y'all. Actually, you know what? This is a perfect this is perfect screenshot material. Hold on. <laughs> there you go. This is perfect screenshot material. I don't know if me using push pauses my game feed as well too. I hope it doesn't. I don't think it does. If it does, my bad. I kind of posted spoilers a little bit with that screenshot, but like, I don't know, this game's like over 20 years old. It'll be okay. I think, I think the chat on screen makes up for it. Yeah. Post the tweets. Six stuff. This game's so good. This game's pretty heckin' good. Anyways, I'm gonna be quiet for the rest of this, let you all enjoy it while I prepare for PMD. Also, gonna run a few minutes of ads too while I'm at it. So, enjoy that. So, when we get back, I'll do some mystery dungeon, explore the sky. Show run ads during the credits. I don't want to let y'all. If y'all haven't seen this, I won't let y'all. I won't let y'all. Anyways, bye.